Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Demaya, if you're new here. This is my beautiful sister, Jaisha, modeling for me. Okay, so in this next clip, you just see me showing you guys stretchy fabrics. Um, I like to use bright colors because I feel like this is a vacation piece and I like to wear bright colors on vacation. So yeah, you'll need two yards of that fabric. And that's if you're my size or smaller. If you're thicker than me, then you might need more. Just check the description box and I'll have more instructions. So right here, you just see me cutting down the fold of the fabric that's already there when you buy it. Um, so that makes it 10 times easier. I wish I was more in frame, but yeah, that's all I'm doing. And then I'm just gonna take one side and put it to the side because you don't need it right now. That's your skirt. So to get that long length for your top, you need to cut that yard in half. So I'm just cutting it down the middle. And you do not have to be perfect with um, your cutting skills because I promise you, you're gonna see that it doesn't matter in the end because the skirt, I mean, the shirt is gonna be like, it's gonna be rolled up in a sense, you'll see. But yeah, I'm just measuring to see what's the middle because I'm just a perfectionist, but you don't have to be this precise. Okay, so now that you have those two halves, you're just gonna flip one side on top of the other. And right side should be touching, so the shiny side should be touching the shiny side. So when you're sewing, you wanna sew on the dull side of your fabric because you don't want the seam to show on the pretty side of your fabric. So I'm just hand sewing because my sewing machine is broken, but if you have a sewing machine, it'll take you two minutes to sew this up. It's just one simple seam. Make sure you backstitch. Also, make sure you use a zigzag stitch, but that's only if you're using a sewing machine. Um, I'll probably include a hand sewing tutorial down below for my old professor. And if you are hand sewing, just have some patience. This took me about 30 minutes, and I tried to make sure I did it really close together. So right here, she's just going to show you guys how to wrap it. Um, this is just a skirt. Make sure both sides are even, and then do a simple knot. I love how one knot looks, but um, I would just tie it twice just to give it more security. Okay, so this is the tricky part, but I promise it's not that hard. Okay, so line that seam up on the side of you, but more towards the back and put one side between your legs. Then cover your boob with one side. Y'all see why I said put it more towards the back because once you pull it, the seam is going to come more towards your side, if that makes sense. But wrap that side around you and put it between your legs. Then grab the other side and wrap it in front of your boob. <laughs> and then take it and put it inside of the other piece. Now pull it up and throw it over your shoulder. And pull it just how she's pulling it so it's nice and tight. Yes, I said taut, not tight, but same thing. <laughs> now she's just taking the other end of the fabric and wrapping it around her stomach. Um, you can wrap it as many times as you want, as long as you have enough fabric um, at the end to tie it in a knot. So she's just wrapping it once and then she's gonna tie a knot at the top of her shoulder. Um, I like to do the top of my shoulder because you just have the fabric hanging at the end, but you can tie it at the bottom, um, whatever works for you. I also forgot to mention that this top is not my design. I saw um, this top in an Instagram ad and I was like, hmm, how can I recreate this? <laughs> so I figured out how they tied it and I did my own. But yeah, this is the finished look and I love it. So yeah, I hope you guys love it too. And if you do recreate this, tag me in the pictures or send me some, I would love to see them. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and turn on your post notifications so you don't miss when I upload. And I'll see y'all in my next one. Bye.